Hey, Dad, can we make s'mores? S'mores? Yeah, s'mores. Yeah. All yeah, right. you're on. Go look in the pantry. Okay. Crawford. Jack, those remains are found in the rubble. They're not dollar hides. What are you talking about? There's goddamn dentures over there. But not his bones. Wrong DNA. And whose are they? St. Louis PD is looking for a Chromalux employee named Ralph Mandy. He was supposed to be on vacation, so nobody missed him for a week. <laughs> what is taking him so long? Are you kidding? It takes him 20 minutes to get out of bed in the morning. Yeah, but now I have a serious marshmallow Jones. <laughs> Josh, what are you doing? Do it now, gumshoe. <laughs> Your son is about to change. Then your wife. You can watch. Then I'll take care of you. Look at you. I've never seen a child as disgusting as you. You pissed your pants? How dare you? You dirty little beast. You want me to cut it off? Is that what you want me to do, you little freak? You want me to cut it off? Do you? Don't cry at me, you little faggot. Apologize. Say I'm sorry, Daddy. I'm a dirty little beast. I'm a freak. Say it. No. Say it. Daddy. Say it or I will cut it off. I'm a no. dirty little beast. Freak. Hairless and no one will ever love me. Get down!
dear Will. You must be healed by now. On the outside, at least. I hope you're not too ugly. What a collection of scars you have. Never forget who gave you the best of them, and be grateful. Our scars have the power to remind us that the past was real. We live in a primitive time, don't we, Will? Neither savage nor wise. Half measures are the curse of it. Any rational society would either kill me or put me to some use. Do you dream much, Will? I think of you often. Your old friend, Hannibal Lecter. Hannibal, there's someone here to see you. Wants to ask you a few questions. I said you'd probably refuse. A young woman says she's from the FBI, though she's far too pretty, if you ask me. I'll tell her you said no. What is her name? Dear doctor, I have admired you for years. I wanted to tell you I'm delighted that you've taken an interest in me. I don't believe you tell them who I am. Besides, the important thing is what I am becoming. I have some things I'd love to show you. Until then, I remain your most avid fan. families killed a month apart in their homes. These attacks were highly organized. The victims carefully chosen. This one is gonna go on and on. That's the same atrocious aftershave you wore in court. I need your advice, Dr. Lecter. If you recall, Will, our last collaboration ended rather messily. How is young Josh and the lovely Molly? They're always in my thoughts, you know. So it's true the Lecter's actually helping with your investigation. We may have a little over three weeks before this freak does it again. I might not have time. I do. I have oodles. You want to know how he's choosing them, don't you? This is a very shy boy, Will. I know what it's like to have people always thinking that you're different. <laughs> He is refining his methods. He is evolving. What am I doing here? No one will ever be safe around you, Will. A note hidden in Lecter's cell. The killer wants Lecter to answer him through the personal columns. Lecter gave me your home address. Hi. I'm a friend of your father's. Open your eyes. No. I am the dragon. Give me what I need. Before me, you tremble. I'll call you if I think of anything else. Would you perhaps like to leave me your home number? <laughs> 